day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah, hallelujah. To God be the glory for all the good things he's done in our lives. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Love you. It's the principle hey, hey. of it. It was very well worth the time we spent. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. Now, Brother Al's going to chew on a little bit more, but you see where I'm coming from? He, all That's I know crazy. is that God is a just God. But he's yep. trying to say, look, Jesus did it on the cross. He, he Before he even died, that is asked, he said, forgive them. But they know not what they do. In the death of, in the, in the, in the face of dying, he forgave he them. Mm -hmm. Forgive them. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I'm not saying. I know it. Well, that mm -hmm. I don't forgive. Yes, I know you're not. I'm not you're saying, saying that. Is Believe that, me, I am not. You, I think you're saying is that my salvation is not tied up with my forgiveness. Unforgive. That's what I'm forgive. saying. That's what you're saying. That's and what I, I'm saying. I'm saying is that the parables that you just read show that what's given can be taken away. Wow. That yeah. is deep, man. That is deep. Yeah, I, I ain't said that. I, I, that's I have good to, stuff I, right there. That's good stuff. <laughs> I, I like that. Eat, eat on that one, but I just can't imagine. Uh, I mean, I, 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 what, what comes to mind is David saying, "Don't take, you know, spirit away from me. Your your spirit away." But we have His spirit. Yeah, I mean, me, 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 and Christ are one. You know, I and him, and he and me, and 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 just it just blows my mind. I mean, my mind can't even fathom. I, I, let me tell you what not, it is. Huh? Remember when you said the bread that does not produce will be fulfilled? Well, I'm not. I'm not. I'm. Look, I do not acquaint myself with that branch or anything. All I'm saying is my brain. <laughs> I love you, man. <laughs> My brain can't even fathom the separation I of my father I from me. You. It's just you. not in me. My my brain don't work like that. Praise you. you know, but, God, okay. and, and, I'm just trying to understand it. And part of your brain, though, is that are we free to 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 commit atrocities and 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 not ask for forgiveness to God? Is is what I'm trying to understand. I guess when your nature changes to the point where that's not a consideration but, on your part. I, know, I think that's, that's the point. It's not a consideration. But I'm not saying that that <clears throat> that that's the way it is. I, I know if somebody goes out and let's just say some some kid, you know, the kid that went to I can't remember the school shot up all them other kids. Okay, then he goes to prison. And that's an atrocity, but he can still you know, have his soul saved. Yes, he can. You know, and uh, and if Hitler, with all that he done, yep. Christ yet died for his soul. Yep. And if he if he repented, and if he knew a bad part of body, is he would be. So if he it's repented. Just, and that, now I'm not saying that that's what you do, and, and if you're not repentive, then I, then you know uh, I just can't imagine you being saved because it just doesn't in my mind it just doesn't it doesn't compute. There you go. You know what I'm saying? It just it it doesn't doesn't add up. It doesn't make sense. It just my spirit doesn't agree with. Uh, <coughs> with God being separated from me. There's just nothing in me. And I'm talking about me. Now, I'm not saying that I don't forgive because I do. There, There's, I don't, I mean, believe it or not, I, I forget that idiot in, 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 in the White House. Yeah. Believe it or not. I had to work and, that every day for you. But yeah. he still, he still vexes me. Yeah. And it bothers me some of the stuff that, that he does and says. Not just him, but a whole lot of these politicians. 
but you know i can't hold anything against them because that's what politicians do you know that's just who they are and um <clears throat> but as far as me myron and the, the the spirit that's within me this this new regenerated spirit of, of god close the door baby and um it just blows my mind uh in a good way that i'm just that one with my father and my lord and savior jesus christ because i can't think of myself apart from them you know i you know i, I would want to elder i agree with you brother addison if, if as long as you said i still think as long as we abide in him is the key yeah. i this is this is a favorite scripture elder that i i like yeah. just to read as the old testament but it kind of equals the day uh, it says here i'm gonna get i'm bringing it up you i think elder, you may have read i don't think you read this one before but this is one of my favorite ones this is ezekiel uh, and I think I'll start at 18, but it's talking about the way of God. It says, As for his father, because he cruelly oppressed, spoiled his brother by violence, and did that which is not good among his people, lo, even he should die in his inequity. Yet say ye, why? does not the son bear the iniquity of the father when the son has done that which is lawful and right and has kept all my statues statues and has done them he shall surely live the soul that sinneth, it shall die the son shall not bear the iniquity of the father and that's even we talk about past slaves and all this stuff Neither shall the father bear the iniquity of the son. The righteousness of the righteous shall be upon him, and the wickedness of the wicked shall be upon him. But if the wicked would turn <coughs> from all his sins yes, we about that. that he has committed, and keep all my statutes, and do that which is lawful and right, he should surely live. He shall not die. All his transgressions, I like that, Elder, that he has committed, <coughs> they shall not be mentioned unto him. And his righteousness that he has done shall he live. I have, have I any pleasure at all that the wicked shall, shall die, says the Lord God. And not that he should return from his place and live. But when the righteous turn away, now here's a, here's a piece, Elder. When the righteous turns away from his righteousness, Elder, and commits iniquity, and does, does according to all the abomination that the wicked man does, shall he live? All his righteousness that he has done, Elder, shall not be mentioned. And his trespass, <clears throat> that he has trespassed, and in his sin, that he has sinned, and them shall he die. Yet you say, the way of the Lord is not equal. Hear now, O house of Israel, is not my way equal? Are not your ways unequal? When, and this is what he's explained, when a righteous man turns away from his righteousness and commits his iniquity and dies <laughs> for his iniquity that he has done, shall he die? Again, look at this, I like this part, but that's the repentance piece. Now, I like this. Again, when the wicked man turns away from his wickedness that he has committed 
and has done that which is lawful and right, he <laughs> shall Baby. save his soul. But consider and turn us away from all his transgressions that he has committed, he should surely live. He shall not die. Yes, said the house of Israel. The way of the Lord is not equal. O house of Israel, are not my ways equal? Are not your ways unequal? Therefore, I will judge, O house of Israel, everyone according to his ways, says the Lord God. Repent. And like Jesus said in the New Testament, he came, repent for the kingdom of heaven is in the hand. Repent and turn yourselves from all your transgressions, so iniquity shall not be your ruin. Cast away from you all your transgressions, whereby you transgress, and make a new heart and a new spirit. Oh, Ellen, new spirit. You heard that, Ellen? Yes, sir. For why would you die, O house of Israel? For I have no pleasure in the death of him that dies to the Lord. Wherefore, turn yourselves and do what other and live. Sure. Even yeah. in the Old Testament, if you turn, then 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 God said, I ain't gonna mention your transgressions. <clears throat> I ain't gonna mention it. Yeah. But you know they that was still the Old Testament and, and they said they live by the law. And they, they couldn't they couldn't do it. We there, there therefore he said Jesus to give us the grace that we need. Ow. But the it was intent is, with his life. Yeah, but the ten is I need you to turn his way. That's why I think you know Jesus. I think Elder. That's what that John fourteen six says. I'm the way, the truth, the truth and the truth life. And the life. Mm -hmm. Nobody coming to the Father but by me. Yeah. And that's why he's saying the way of him is where all your past transgressions shall not be mentioned. All your transgressions shall not be mentioned. If you go the way, but if you don't know how to forgive everybody else, because that's a lot of forgiveness, ain't you ever you, you saw in that one to me. And they're talking about they wanted the son. <coughs> they they back in those days, those times, they wanted the son to pay as well as the father for the yeah. transgression. Yeah. Yeah. That's a that's a big that's a big change, man. It put it, it see the though. Outside of Christ, a lot of principles are still in place. It's still in place. I think yeah. so. You had to come into the kingdom in order not to be under that law. You and know, stay in the kingdom, right? Jesus, yeah. Yeah. And, and stay in the kingdom. So it's not, I don't think, I got, to me, I like this one. Because I just love this one. I used to read this one. Yeah, uh, but as the lie. Yeah. But I like this one. Because it just said it. I like the fact you said it. Turn yourself and turn yourself. Yeah. Turn yourself and turn yourself. Yeah. Turn yourself and turn yourself. Yeah. Turn yourself and turn yourself. None of that stuff will be uh It won't separate you from God. It won't separate from you won't die for it. Yeah. That's all he's asking us to do. You know? And that's being and I like the fact is that scripture read in the old test New Testament, he's talking about the fact is forgive your enemies. It, it lines up with the what Romans? It's like or was it was it in the New Testament with gospel where he said it's like you pray for somebody and it's like pouring coals of fire on oh, yeah. <laughs> If you hear me hungry, feed him. If you thirst, give him the drink. For yeah. so doing, it'll be like he can cold the fire in his head. Come on, brother. So, so chew on it, brother Addison, from your perspective, because that's worth chewing on. But uh, I'm chewing. <laughs> and I think I think God is just trying to tell us something. That's all. You know. I, I, to me, it's the path to elevation. It is. The alignment with the Father is what's essential, because He can move people like He wants to. But you know, He got to move people in the place that. It is mold. It's mold, you yeah. You want representatives to, to occupy the highest place. And so you got to have a loving heart. I mean, the system is flipping upside down. He's, he's really flipping the world upside down again. Yeah. And if we get up there and do the same thing our oppressors did, there won't be no improvements. There won't be no glory of the kingdom won't even be displayed. Yeah. So he's yeah. got to, he's managing our hearts right now. And, yeah. and I think just to be able to submit to that yeah. guidance, is our task. If we can yeah. submit ourselves to his, 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 his lordship, to his rulership, nah, I might not want to forgive, but because he said so, 
I'm empowered through for you. And I, I accept it, you know, because yeah. I crucified the flesh and live out that life. Let him live out that life with me. Exactly. But in exactly. our flesh, we in our flesh, our flesh ain't gonna do it. You exactly. know, we really have to walk out of the spirit. If we can't walk out of the spirit, we, it, you know, we can rack it up like nah, they don't get Amen. it. Amen. So when we look at we look at Chris and we look at uh and I'm not angry with them, brother. I mean I really don't disagree with them in the flesh. I, I we don't want to part. But I do believe that it is operating in the flesh. Yeah. I, I, and I don't think that, that it's going to reap the benefit they want it to because right. you might find yourself going fist to cuff or bullet for bullet with somebody you ain't even got to do that with. Right. You never... Yeah, it, it, thinking that way <laughs> yeah, but, but and, you know and what? dwelling on it and meditating on that, that type of uh, mannerism leads you to act mm. rationally if you're put in that position. Yeah. You know, you, you, you will... You think after the flesh, you will act out after the yeah, flesh. Yeah, yeah. And I, and I have to remind remind myself of the miracle that Jesus, even with Peter, Peter never pulled a gun. He didn't slap Ananias' fire thing. They were spoken word, and they both dropped dead. Yeah. And then and then when Jesus spoke word, people come back to life. So we actually are privy to, you know, experiences that the world system can't really function in. Nope. You're not going to get that out of the world system, speaking the word, somebody's going to drop dead, or, you know, you're not going to get the angelic protection outside of Christ. He gives angels charge over you to bag you up, you dash your foot against the phone. Yeah. So we don't cause ourselves, we don't align ourselves in, in a way that we can accept those blessings that God has secured for us at the cross. Come on. We're members of the kingdom of God, man. I mean, who can get to us that God don't let? And that's Amen. why he calls us peculiar people. Yes, sir. We ain't got to be scared of nothing. I mean, if you say you gonna walk through the crowd, ain't nobody gonna touch you. That's a done deal. If you say you can walk on water, who can stop you? I mean, yeah. like, Amen. That's Amen. the people that we really are. But it's hard to think like that because we're coming out this place and trying to live and grow in that spirit. I'm, exactly. I'm, I'm excited about trying to get there. That's what yeah. I really do, man. I pray for you allow me to taste a little bit of it. You know what I'm saying? Before I, I need to get that. And I think, and I think, and the other thing too is that if faith comes by hearing, so the, these all it, the Bible got so many topics, yeah, man, to, to look at and dwell on. But it, it's got to be taught. Unforgiveness has to be taught. Bearing fruit you? has to be taught. Beatitude has to be taught. It has to be heard. And it's, it's not, you know, maybe every three years you get to it, but you need to cover the full gospel. You know, I, I can apply. Take, this, take I'm gonna take this little minute. To say this, but. Jesus has been given to us as the example. Yes, sir. He is a prototype of our kind. We are all been transformed into his image, his yes, functionality. Sir. All that he did in the flesh, we're able to do. Come on, brother. I mean, <laughs> that's what he came to show it to us. That we can't walk on water under the certain circumstances. We can raise the dead and open blind and eyes. And he said greater works we would do. Yes, sir. And, and, and that's, that's, I mean, teaching gives you anticipation or expectation of something. Yes, sir. And if we keep teaching at that level, then we're going to keep striving to get to that level. Exactly. And I think we're just recently even coming to the realization that we can attain to that level. Come on now. <clears throat> so as we as we walk this thing out and realize how to get there, mm -hmm. abiding in Christ means forgiving your enemy, turning the other cheek, blessing them that curse you, going the extra mile, all that stuff that the crucified your flesh is a part of that scenario. Amen. And when we can submit to that point, then he can pour out the rest of the rooms. And that's that's what that's that's why I'm I'm really I'm praying to God that we get the strength not to get in that fight. Amen. Let's not fight like the world. If we nope. get in the world fight, man, we're gonna degrade ourselves so bad it's gonna be ridiculous. We're gonna we'll never make it to the pinnacle that way. God yeah, ain't gonna allow it to happen. I think all we're trying to do some way do the world way is playing musical chairs and, and change the positions of Who's the oppressor? Who's the who's being oppressed? And I do not believe we were created for that. I believe we were created to rise it. above it. I truly right. believe we were created to rise above it. Exactly. That's what we want. And so set your affections to things above. Amen. Preach. Yeah. Add your prayers Preach. out because I don't think Brother Adams one. Put your prayers out, Brother Adams. Yeah, prayers out. Okay. Amen. Praise them. When he started this thing a long time ago, when he prayed that prayer. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Father, we, we truly thank you for this time that we had to share. We thank you for the Holy Spirit who's bringing all truth, Lord. Yes, yes. Thank you for being here in the midst of us. Welcome, Lord. Thank you for 
for your word, Lord God. Yes, Thank Lord. you for the renewing of our minds, Lord Come God. On. Thank you for perfecting us mm. to do the work of the ministry, Lord yes. God. Thank you, Jesus. We thank you that you have made us a peculiar people, Lord God. Mm. We thank you that we stand out amongst our peers, Lord God, that those who are seeking you, that we are that, that light that's set on a hill, Lord God, that they can come to us. Lord God, we thank you for the love that you shed abroad in our hearts, Lord God. Come on. Thank you, Lord God, that for, for us, folks, that you put together, those people of like precious faith, Father, that we can let iron sharpen iron, Father oh. God. We do not take this lightly, Lord God. We take this commission, Father, yeah. to do your will. Your will. That it be done here on earth yes. as it is in heaven. Yes. We truly ask that you... Have your angels depart, north, east, and west, and south, Father God, protecting all those, Lord God, who may uh, who may need it. Yes. Uh, thank you for putting a hedge around our home, Lord God, on this night, so that no hurt, harm, or danger shall come to pass. Hmm. Truly give you all glory and honor and, and praise, and we ask for perfect peace as we sleep in this night. Yes, Lord. As we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen, amen. Hey, you have a good night. Tell your wife, I'm sorry. We... Uh, we, we, we just caught in Look, I'm the man of this house. No, I'm just yeah. kidding. <laughs> Not yet. No. <laughs> yeah, true. You better act like it. <laughs> and, and, and calm yourself and your wife, brothers. <laughs> yes, I'll be sleeping out here. <laughs> yeah, you'll still be the man of the house. you yeah. just be sleeping outside. <laughs> yeah, that's why we're calling in the spirit. <laughs> All right. Love, love you, Bill. Love the third, man. Okay, sir. Have a good one. All right. Y'all yeah, yeah, be blessed tonight. Bye bye. Hey, uh, Ash, when we get together tomorrow, all right? He left. Yeah. Okay, I got him. All right, yeah. Uh, all right. Good night. Good night.